We are back at the NBC Sports Studio here at Levi Stadium with the U.S. Army Game of the Week. Argonaut enters the postseason as the 11th seed in Division 6, coming in third place in the Motherload League. There's a Motherload League? There sure is. Yeah, Wait, did the you? Motherload. I'm going to say nothing about that. Argonaut <laughs> taking the 70-mile trip north to take on six-seeded Colfax. Colfax also coming in third place in the league. The Falcons looking to keep its season alive and win a mother load of a game with a win over the Mustangs in our U.S. Army Game of the Week. It's a frigid Friday night in Colfax where the Falcons are set to take on Argonaut and the Mustangs early just firing on all cylinders after a touchdown in the first drive, the defense standing strong. That's Robert Spigarelli with the sack. And in the next Argo drive, the Mustangs do the sneaky reverse. Lance Hansen hands it off to Robert Prather and it fools everyone. He gets taken down by Blake Albert after a lengthy gain, picking the drive up in the second quarter. Spigarelli makes his way into the end zone for the short punch in. It's 14-0. Argo. Colfax gets on the board with two minutes to go before the break. Malachi Thompson breaks multiple tackles and gets in there with the 15-yard score. Less than a minute left in the first half. Argo at midfield. Mateo Flores gets the handoff and he is off to the races. Mateo outruns everyone, giving his team six more and the two-point conversion makes it 22-7 Argonaut at the half. Are you smelling an upset? Well, Colfax sure isn't in the third quarter. Cannon Tomlin gets the handoff and he shoots into the end zone. Tomlin with a huge second half. The successful two-point conversion cuts the Argo lead to seven. And in the closing seconds of the third quarter, Malachi Thompson cuts left and bulldozes his way into the end zone. This game is tied. The Falcon defense is stepping up big. Luke Tanini creating a brick wall nowhere for that Mustang to run. Now in the final minute of the game, still tied at 22. Roach with a pass to Kenny Gold. Gold gets out of bounds to stop the clock and it puts Colfax in field goal range. Tomlin sets up for the 22-yarder. Cannon kicks it high and deep and it is through the uprights. That wins the game for Colfax as the Falcons advance to the Division 6 semifinals. Strawberry from KISS 107.9 with the Falcons after the thrilling finish. Today was a do or die situation and Colfax had no give up in them. The Falcons were flying. What's up, gentlemen? Yeah! This was a nail biter. Let me talk to Malachi. So you guys came out with the victory, but you're down 22 to seven at halftime. I want to know what coach said to get into you guys to shut that team down for the second half and come away with the win. Um, we knew it was gonna be hard. You just don't give up. It's gonna be hard running football the whole game. It was. Just didn't give up. Speaking of hard, uh, let's talk to how cold it is out here. People watching TV have no idea what 44 degrees feels like. Cannon, I imagine the turf feels like concrete. Every hit hurts. What does this cold do to your team? I mean, we practice it every morning. We're used to it. It just drives us. We know they can't handle it, but we can, and we're going to make plays on it. Love it. Love it. <laughs> Amadeus right here. This was a win or go home game. What does it mean for you and the rest of the team to extend your season and keep playing again next week? It means everything to give the seniors uh, the last home game that we missed out on against NU. Yeah, all right. Kenny, one last question. How long do we celebrate this before it's back to business and we're focusing on the next, uh, next challenge? Because you guys deserve to celebrate this game, but how long does it go? Uh, it starts tomorrow. We lock in tomorrow, come to breakfast, we have fun in the morning, and then it's game time. Well, I'll let you guys go celebrate right now then. My name is Strawberry on the radio on V101.1 and the brand new KISS 107.9. Colfax Falcons, take it away. Yeah, baby, baby, baby. Hey, family on three, one, two, three. Family! Family! Family!